The city of Pismo Beach is permanently closing the iconic slides at Pier Plaza, citing several lawsuits and coastal erosion. KSBY's Kimberly Cruz has more on the mixed reaction to the closure. These are the signs that are up now. They actually block the entrance to the slides. Now, some of the people that I spoke with today tell me they understand why they are being closed, while others tell me they aren't happy to hear the news. A fan favorite attraction in Pismo Beach <laughs> is saying goodbye forever. I'm really sad about it. I really love those slides, and when we come down here and visit, um, we have just so many memories, so I'm really upset. I think it's a bummer. You know what I mean? They're taking something away from the kids that the kids love, and I feel like it's made Pismo, like the sign, and then the slides, and then the ocean. The playground area at the Pier Plaza opened back in 2020 as part of a revitalization project. Well, I came here with my friend from Minnesota, and that was one thing I wanted to show her was the slide because we've had other company come and we've talked them into going down. But since opening, multiple lawsuits have been filed against the city by people alleging they were injured while using the slides. I've never gotten hurt, and I don't think my mom has either, so. Well, I think it makes sense because if people were getting injured, it doesn't make sense sense to keep it open, especially if there were serious injuries, because the person we talked into going down kind of had a bad landing. In August 2022, we reported that the Frederick law firm based in Napomo had filed 20 lawsuits related to alleged injuries from the slides and more have been filed since. There are two warning signs placed near the slides stating the structures are designed for kids ages 5 through 12 and that falls may result in serious injury. My daughter would literally come out like that's the first thing she would look forward to is like, dad, let's go to the slides. You know what I mean? And I'd go my, you know, I'd go down myself too. You know what I mean? And it's just crazy because there's signs there that gives some warnings like you know what I mean you might get hurt it's on you for some parents it was a risk they were well aware of of course I mean with anything you know there's a risk you know playing on the playground here there's a risk your kid could fall off and, and injure themselves so you know I still let my kid go on it and took that risk for myself as a parent you know and I don't think anyone else would be responsible for that in a statement the city of Pismo Beach said quote the city of Pismo Beach has decided to close the slides from the pier plaza down to the beach pending litigation resulting from repeated misuse of the slides left little choice but to permanently close this unique coastal amenity. As of now, there's no information as to what the city plans to do with the area. In Pismo Beach, Kimberly Cruz, KSBY News. City officials also say the slides have been closed for the past six months because coastal tides caused the sand to recede at the base of the slides. And we reached out to the law firm who represents several clients who filed lawsuits and they said in part, quote, as our office has alleged in the pending lawsuits, the city and other entities involved in the construction of the slides designed the slides as a feature attraction for use by people of all ages. However, it came to light that the city became aware of the inherent risks involved in the slides but failed to implement adequate safety measures, end quote.